They'll be given marks for cooking, entertainment and even sleeping arrangements. Our new series House Guest continues at 3 o'clock. Now though, it's the real deal. Hello, and welcome to Dickinson's Real Deal from Edgebaston. This is the show where you have to gamble to get the most money for your antiques. So how can you do that? Well, you can sit down with one of our dealers and accept a cash offer on the spot. Or you can gamble and go to auction in the hope of getting more money there. But there are no guarantees. The good people of Edgebaston have gathered here today at the famous Edge Baston Cricket Ground, and they're hoping to put our dealers on a sticky wicket and walk away with the real deal. First up in the dealer's den, Karen hopes she's onto a winner. She's got Ian surrounded by cuties in uniform, her Bunnikins collection. Could you tell me when you started collecting these and why? I went past the shop window, I noticed the policeman, he just took my eye. Mm -hmm. I just fancied it. You fancied a policeman? Yes. Oh, okay. And ever since, when I got a little bit of money on one side, I just brought them every, every now and again and I've started building them up. They're by Dalton. That's right. Which is a very good factory, you know, very collectible. And what makes you come to sell them? It goes towards the car. I hope I'm not paying for the car. You're paying for the wheels. Mm -hmm. Just for the wheels. Yes. How old is your car? 15 years old. 15 years old. Oh, definitely it needs to change. Here we do. I agree. What if I start with 20 pounds? It's not enough. Sorry. Not enough? No. What if I said a second 20 pounds? I'd like some more if possible. A lot more? What if I said another 10? Do you another 20? Well, what if I said I took that away and gave you 20, making it 60? I'll do a deal on that. You'll do a deal on 60? Yes, I'll. I think it's fair. Yeah. Thank you very much. Thank, thank, thank you, you very much. Okay, thank you. Ian? We'll have a word with you. <laughs> Hi, David. <laughs> now, it looks to me that you've, um, you've bought these fabulous bunnikins rather cheaply. I'm sure we could put another £20 in. I think it's so. It's not bad, lad. Would okay. you like another £20? Another £20 pounds would help with your car. It would help me. Would it? Thank you very well, much. Give it another 20 quid. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. That's going to help. And maybe, at the end of the day, not a bad deal. Thank you, David. Well, we bought some bits and pieces of silver in with you today, Anthony. 